What's up, Dragon Nation? I'm Rich with Dragon Nation Gaming. Welcome back to Astroneer. Last episode, uh, we got the soil centrifuge. We also did a few other things. I can't remember everything. Uh, what we want to do in this episode is I want to try to go to our first planet. I don't know if we'll be able to get to it in this episode, but I at least want to try to get everything ready. So let's go ahead and get this started. So I went on the store. There is a store you can actually go into if you go escape. Uh, I can't remember. It's somewhere. I think it might be the... No? It's somewhere. Th there is a store that you can go to. Maybe it's this one. No, that's creative mode? I didn't know you can go in creative mode. Holy shit. I gotta find it. Where is it? It's around here somewhere. I think it might... There it is. Enter store. So, in the store, you could buy some cubits. And when you get the cubits, you can actually buy. There's a couple of suits, a couple of emotes, some pallets, hats, masks, and visors. So, I went ahead and got the happy blue visor. And that's the one that I have on right now. It gives me kind of a, a little bit of a face on my visor. I thought that was kind of cool. But yeah, not a whole lot else. Uh, everything else didn't really seem all that great. I just kind of like the visor, decided to go ahead and get it. Alright, so what we want to do today is we want to try to go to our first planet. Uh, the one we're going to be going to is Glacio. I'm going there so I can try to get uh, a lot more bites. So that way we can unlock a lot of stuff for like power. Because power is, right now power is a big issue. We just, we don't have solar panels, we don't have wind turbines. Uh, one thing I could do is I could go around the planet real quick and just try to find what I can, just make a bunch of tethers. But it's a lot easier just to go to Glacio and do that. Uh, there are a few things that I am going to need though. Uh, so we're just getting everything ready. What I need is I already made a beacon, which you can make from, uh, what is it? The stuff you make less from. Damn it, quartz. <laughs> that quartz. Another thing we're gonna need, if we go in here, we're gonna need a packager. Because what we're gonna try to do is we're gonna try to open up research canisters. Uh, the same ones we found down here on the planet, but on Glacio, they're worth 7,400 7, bytes. So what we can do is when we do find those, uh, they're too big to fit in our backpack and we're gonna have to get a f small shuttle in the beginning and We would only be able to carry one But we can use a packager on it to make it uh, So we can carry one on our backpack or eight of them I'm hoping if we have an empty backpack, but we could also carry them on this storage the medium storage So we got that but for that we need graphite so I need to make eight graphite. I already got two. Uh, the next thing we're going to need is an oxygenator. Now, the oxygenator, I'm not going to put on the shuttle right away. Uh, it does fit in one slot, like in the storage right here. So I'm just going to go ahead and build it, put it right there. Then when we get on the planet, we'll go ahead and use it. And then we'll leave it on the planet with the beacon. Next thing we're going to need is, I think it's in this one. We're also going to need a solid fuel thruster. Now, this only has a one-time use, a round trip. I could go to a planet and then come back. Later on, when we get the hydrazine thruster, I think we can make uh, nine trips. Nine round trips, something like that. It's a lot more. 
but the one thing we need that I don't think I can get yet. Yes, I can. Small shuttle. All right, uh, that one's going to take two aluminum. So let's go in and grab that real quick. Because that is going to take a while. I need to get rid of this. I made two research chambers, so that way we can try to get all that research. But right now, I want to go ahead and try to make the shuttle. All right, where is it? There it is. So yeah, this thing's not gonna be too big. We can carry this right here, which just has the two connection slots, if I could get underneath it to see. Yeah, if you look underneath, there's two connection slots that will fit on the small shuttle. But right now, that's it. That's all that will fit there. Uh, it would be nice if I could get some iron as well, but we might have to make a few trips for that. All right, let's get some more research. Try to get rid of all the research that I can get. Uh, yeah, power is an issue. So I did find this down in the cave. This is a medium generator. You can actually build this later on, but it takes resources we don't have right now. Uh, what you do is you take organic, put it in the smelter, you make carbon, and that is the fuel. But the problem is, is first you have to smelt it, which draws a lot of power. So you kind of have to get a bunch of organic. Now, organic I can make in the soil centrifuge, but that just uses up uses up soil. I mean, for other things. So right now we do have our small generators. I'm just going to use those for right now until I can get stuff cooked up. And four. So yeah, with the uh, organic we have right now, we'll go ahead and put that in the smelter. Is that all I got? Yeah, that's all I got. And I also got the drill. I can't remember if we got that in last episode. Drill mod one. But yeah, we have that now. All right, so what we need to do is we need six more graphite. I might have one, two, three. No, we have enough soil to finish that. All right, so let's see if I can find it. There it is, packager. Like I said, we're going to need... I would like to try to find all the research that we can. So I'm going to go ahead and make eight of these. Not sure if we'll actually be able to find that much, but we'll give it a shot. Then what we need, we need uh, six small generators. But those are made from compound. If we find compound on the planet that we're going to, uh, Glacio... That would be extremely helpful, but I don't know if we'll be able to. All right, there's some more graphite. And we'll get those made real quick. Oh, I guess I should start this centrifuge now. We do need a couple more. That's what, four? Yeah, I think that's four. All right, it looks like the smelter is done. And there's our shuttle. All right, now we need to see what else we need to make. So let's go ahead and put the shuttle over on the landing pad over here. Because every time you come back to this planet, it'll land right at the landing pad. Now, there is a landing pad that you can build on planets. Uh, we just have to get that at some point. As you can see, we can fit an oxygen generator in there. But there's also a two slot to fit a storage container. Or storage device item whatever this thing we're gonna put that in there actually let me go ahead and grab the beacon I'll put it on my backpack so that way we have the room and we'll go ahead and make some more graphite oh let's get rid of this one there we go and that right there should be enough uh, it looks like we're out of power hold on let me grab some real quick we do have one carbon, I think. Yeah, just one. All right, we'll grab that. And there we go. All right, so we need two more packages. So yeah, since we can make the uh, small generators out of compound, we should be able to find compound on the planet. Each planet has everything you need in order to build a shuttle. 
a way of getting off the planet. So we should be able to find resin, compound, uh, aluminum, ammonium, and yeah, there's probably a few other things on every planet. I'm not sure exactly though. I haven't really taken the time to look. All right, two more. One. And two. All right, let's go ahead and put these on and then we can go ahead and put this on the shuttle. Next thing we're gonna need is uh, the thruster. Now, in order to make the thruster, we need ammonium and aluminum, I think. Let's actually see. Uh, thruster is all the way down. There we go. Uh, ammonium and aluminum. Well, I haven't found any ammonium yet, so we're gonna go ahead and make that in the soil centrifuge. Uh, we could only make one. It's unfortunate. Because later on, we'll be working with a lot of ammonium. So it would be nice if we could make more, but eh, it is what it is. All right, so we can go ahead and get rid of the printer, put the other research chamber on. And we're out of power already. Damn, that carbon went quick. All right, I need to go ahead and get some resin, get that smelted up so we can make some more power. And I only got one item left. So I think I had like 15 research items. That's how much we spent so far. Oh yeah, and all this right here, I dug out for all the soil that I needed to get to this point. Alright, that should... Are we full? Yeah, we're full. I'm gonna have to come back for the rest of it. But that should give us enough carbon to finish out the day. Well, no, because I need power right now. All right, let's go ahead and put these in the small generator. And we'll get the smelter running. <laughs> get as much carbon as possible. Ah, that should be enough for right now. All right, so we got our ammonium. And we need aluminum. Now we come to the small printer. We can go ahead and print out that thruster. Uh, next thing we're gonna need is the oxygenator, which which is also at the small printer. Let me see what it takes to make that. There it is. Uh, ceramic and aluminum. I should have that. Yes, we do. All right, let's get the thruster out of the way and find the oxygenator. There it is. All right, now the thruster, we can go ahead and bring over to the shuttle. Just put it right underneath. Unbox it. There we go. Now it's ready for a round trip. But yeah, the uh, thruster will actually destroy itself after uh, a second flight. So make sure that you only go to a planet and then back here. Don't go to a planet and then decide to go to another planet because then you'd be screwed. All right, so our oxygenator, we can go ahead and put it on our backpack for right now. All right, so the next thing we want to take is we do need a soil canister, so that way we can make ramps or well, anything we want to do, kind of flatten out the land if we need to. Uh, the beacon, so we can find our spot again. The oxygenator, which is going to be very important, or we won't be able to tether to the shuttle. Uh, drill mods. I just usually just bring the... Drill mod, the boost mod, and the wide mod. Now, that's going to use up a whole lot of power at first. We're not going to have a lot of power. So we have to be very careful with that. And compound so we can go ahead and make some more tethers. So I think... I think that's about it. What I definitely want to bring back with me, iron is also available on that planet, so is titanium. What I want to try next is we need a little bit more storage. Because storage is going fast. We want to get these. So this is the medium storage silo. That one takes titanium. Uh, at some point we do want to get a bigger platform. I'm going to go with this one, which takes iron. So we might have to actually make a couple trips. That's okay. I think, I think we're ready. 
<laughs> I hope. Alright, let's go ahead and make... I'll double check real quick. Let me go ahead and check everything out, make sure we got everything that we need. And then we'll go ahead and go to Glacio. So yeah, preparing for the trip didn't take as long as I thought it would. So yeah, not half bad. Alright, let's grab that carbon. Get the research. There we go. So yeah, let me go and double check, make sure we don't need anything else, and we'll be right back. Alright, I think I think we're ready. I don't think there's anything I'm missing. Yeah, we got three and three bundles of full tethers, and then we got just two tethers right there. Uh, we'll get more once we get down on the planet, but yeah, I think we're okay. I want to wait for a carbon so I can go ahead and try to finish off these research while I'm away. It probably won't finish, but we'll go ahead and try to do the best that we can. Eventually. And what we need to do is we need to make small generators when we get down there as well. So we definitely need to find some compound. But I think we're ready. Alright, let's do this. Our first trip to another planet. And launch. Alright, everything is kind of hanging out just a little bit. But that's okay. Uh, the other thing we're going to need is the canisters. The research canisters also use ammonium sometimes. So it would be nice if we could find some. Alright, so here's the solar system. We have our moon, which we are on the planet Silva. Uh, the moon of Silva is De Solo. Then we got Vizania, which we have to go to next to get lithium for batteries. We have Novus, which is the moon of Vizania. No, I'm not really sure what's the best thing if I could get on it. Hematite. Uh, then we have Aatrox, which we have to go to at some point to get uh, different types of gases. Halidor, which we'll be going to to get copper. That will get us a lot of copper. And there is Glacio. So it's a tundra planet, but it's actually kind of cool. Let's go to it. So yeah, uh, definitely Glacio is my favorite planet. By far. Okay, where did the planet go? I lost the planet. There it is. So it's my favorite planet by far. Not only for resource, but the uh, research, but the uh, resources that we gather are going to be very useful later on. We're going to be using a lot of it. So at some point, I am going to be building a base on Glacio. That might take a little while. A lot of stuff that we need. Alright, so what I'm looking for is one of those alien structures, which are on all the planets, I think. But I want to find a landing zone, which are these bubbles right here, that is close to one of those alien structures. So if I'm traveling around, like a rover or something, I'm driving around and I get lost, all I have to do is find an alien structure and then that will help me find out where my base is. So it would be nice if we could find one that is right on one of those alien structures, but yeah, that might not be possible. We might not find that. Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, no, no bubble. So yeah, let me go ahead and go around the planet one more time and see if we can find one. Oh, wait, I do have a bubble right by that one. Right there. Well, that's going to be our landing zone. Let's see what kind of terrain we got. All right, so the whole planet is an ice planet. It's kind of like Pluto in our solar system. Well, I guess Pluto is no longer a planet. You know what I mean. But what it does have is there are little sections where it's kind of an oasis. Where there is just a little bit of heat. So along with the research canisters, you could also find research right here. I think these get you like 1500. So a lot better than the planet that we're on, Silva. But still not that great. Oh, hey. Oh, we already got a research item right up there. Hold on. So yeah, sometimes on some of the planets you'll find these crashes. And some of them have this right here research item which is buried I can't pick it up there it goes all right now that we got one of those I can actually show you what to do with it 
All right, so the first thing we need to do is right now we will not be able to use tethers because we need to set up the oxygenator. So let's go ahead and grab these out. Go ahead and grab the oxygenator, put it on the ship, unbox it, and now we can tether. All right, so this item right here, now that we got one, we'll go ahead and take the packager. And I kind of like how they design these things. So it's kind of like roller rollers, and these are like ribbons. But yeah, all you have to do is put it right on top of it, or I think you put it on the side too. But yeah, just right on top of it, wait for that button on the top to show green. Hold F. <laughs> and there it is. Now we can actually fit in one spot. Alright, so like I said, I want to try to find eight of those. Uh, there's also also some other stuff that we need to find. Uh, resources. Would be nice if we could find ammonium. Oh, there's the uh, alien thing. Alien structure. I think it's called an alien teleporter. Not sure. Uh, but yeah, we need to find iron. We also need to find titanium. Iron we can find on the surface. Titanium we're going to have to dig down into a cave. Ammonium will also be on the surface. Compound will either be on the surface or in a cave. So it looks like... Yeah, there's a ramp that way or that way. I kind of have to pick and choose which way I want to go. You know what? That one looks... There might be compound right up there. Let's actually go check that out. We'll go this way. And then we'll tether up to that hill try to grab some of that compound so I can get... Uh, the small generators that we're going to be needing. Also, organic, we can find down here when we get up into the tundra, up into this uh, snowy part, or the icy part, we're not going to be able to find a whole lot of organic. It's going to be difficult. Uh, okay, maybe this was not the right spot to go. We'll keep going. Alright, so already found a canister. Let's get rid of that guy before he blows up and kills me. So yeah, I found a canister right here, but unfortunately... Yeah, it requires ammonium. This symbol right here is ammonium. And I do not see any. There's a crash, and there's another one right over there. Uh, so this right here, that is iron. We need to get that at some point. I think it's called hematite? Hold on. And it is very dense, so it's really quick to harvest those things. Yeah, hematite. Alright, I think I saw a compound over here. And I might also... Yeah, let's go ahead and turn off the mods. Because they're going to use up a lot of power, and we just do not have the power for that. So yeah, let's go up here real quick. And this way. Yeah, that looks like compound. Alright, so hopefully this is enough combine. Oh, and hey, there's ammonium right over there, too. Well, and there's another research, uh, research canister. So yeah, we are going to be able to find a lot of those pretty easy. And there's another research item right there. Yeah, they're going to be easy to find. There are tons of them around here. So all we got to do now is collect them. All right, so that hole that we found with the compound, it ran out. But we were able to get a couple of ammonium. So let's use it on this one. And I forgot to bring a packager. Fun times. All right, I need to go back. Holy shit. Okay, so I found everything I needed. We're all good. I went ahead... Uh, they were kind of in the way, so I got rid of the mods. We don't really need them right now. We don't need the power. Or, uh, we don't need... Yeah, well, we'll say power. Uh, also got the small generators and... Yeah, some more tethers. But, look what I just found. Just a row of three of them. So, I'm gonna have to go back and get more packages. I don't have enough. Probably carried two at a time. But I do have one ammonium on me. So, let's get this one right here. And we'll get that one packaged up. Okay, the cool thing about these idiots right here is you can't actually pick them up if they get you get in your way. Alright, so you package. Thank you. And there we go. 
All right, so the next type that we have are the power ones, but there's two different type of power uh, containers. You have one, which you just have to fill up with power. It has a bar that lets you know when it's full. Like this one right here, there's another one which actually does not have that bar. Uh, you have to have a certain amount of power to open it up, which means six ball generators. So all I'm going to do on this one is I'm going to go ahead and put down two. Connect them up. And then turn them on. And now that bar is going to go up and when the bar is full, it will let us get to that container. Or it's that research item. But it looks like I need more ammonium. And while that's doing that, let's go ahead and go over here. There was some ammonium over here, I think. So yeah, one ammonium, and we also need packagers as well. So let me go ahead and grab those. All right, check it out. I found some graphite. So yeah, these crashes right here, you'll find on some of the planets as well. Uh, they actually have resources in them. So that one was graphite, which I really need right now. And that one's ti titanium. It's actually called titanium, titanite, clay and compound. But if I could get the hell out of here, uh, we do have one more research node. I thought, yeah, it's right there. Do I got, I got an ammonium on me, so we're good on that. But yeah, I need to make a packager for it real quick. So we have one extra packager. And not only that, we'll look over there. There's wind turbine. Oh yeah, uh, also, these guys right here, be very careful of them. If you get too close, they explode. Hold on. Try not to die. And, yep, there it goes. So yeah, be very careful of those guys. They, they're kind of assholes, just a little bit. Alright, so, there it is. Let's go ahead and... Ammonium, where are you? There you are. But yeah, I think that's it. We also need a uh, packager. Let's get you out of the way. Go over there. All right, where's the packager? There it is. So yeah, now we have one extra packager. So we're not quite done yet. What I want to do is we want to see if we can't find while we're here. Open up. Where'd that packager go. There it is. I want to see if I can find all the resources we need. So we already found iron. Which is great. But we also need to find Titanite. Titanium. So we can get everything else we're going to need. Uh, so I think... I think we have eight now. We have eight research items. Yeah, we didn't actually have to go that far. I mean, the ammonium that I was picking up is just right here. So yeah, not too bad. If we start running out of uh, items, we could always just come back. But by that time, I'll be ready to make a uh, build a base over here. Also found some more compound as well. That's cool. Nah, I'll leave the iron for right now. I'll just go ahead and make some trips on my own. Try to grab some resources. Uh, what we do need is titan uh, titanium. Because I would like a bigger storage to come to the planet with. To try to get those resources. So I definitely need titanium. Let me see. Can I open that up yet? I don't think I can. Uh, down to the storage. No, I can't. I have to research. This right here. The medium storage silo. That will allow us to get 24 items, I do believe. 4, 8, 12, and then there's another 12 on the other side. So yeah, 24 items with one load. That would be extremely helpful. Yeah, that's it. We're done. Hold on, let me double check. One, two, three. That side's full. That side's full. <laughs> We're done. All right, now what we need to do, I can go ahead and get rid of all this crap. Uh, we're just going to go ahead and leave it here on the planet. I also need to go ahead and grab some more compound for tethers. Uh, we might need a few to try to find titanium. So let me also go ahead and grab the mods. All right, you need to go up here. Oh, I do have a little bit of tethers left. All right, so drill mod. We won't need that right now, but we will. And there we go. 
All right, let me grab some tethers and then we'll go down into the caves. All right, so now we're ready. You're going to stay here. Hall, you are going to stay here. You're going to go back in the ship, but we need to get rid of the oxygen generator. Right now, I need to grab as much titanium as I can carry. So this right here, uh, you can see the ground, how it has these shapes on it. This is stone, but it's very light stone, so we are able to get through it with our tool, but very slowly. Now, if I turn on the drill mod, it's going to use up a lot, po a lot of power, but it'll be able to dig through it faster. So we don't really need it right now, but later on when we get to more dense stuff, more dense stone, we're absolutely going to need it. So let's go ahead and actually turn that off. We don't need it right now. What I need to do is try right here. Let's go ahead and build our ramp down and see what we can find. This might take me a little bit, so I'll go ahead and do it on my own. Actually, I lied. It didn't take me long at all to get to the edge. Alright, I need... I need to get to the point where I can drop another tether so we can look out. Alright, let's open this up so we can actually see what the hell's going on. Actually, this is not bad. Going right to that pillar right there. Or is that just a thing hanging down? Alright, so this is the first tier of tunnels. Oh, hey, look what we found already. Holy shit, that was quick. This is Titanite. This is what we get to uh, get titanium. So what I need to do is I need to empty out inventory. Uh, okay, let me go ahead and uh, mine some of that out. All right, we don't... Uh, we'll keep these tethers right here so that way we can move around, try to grab as much as we can and fill up on it. Actually, hold on. Yeah, as you can see, there are a couple missing from this uh, pile. And there's a couple right there. So what I need to do is clear up that pile real quick. So that way it's only one stack of tethers. All right, so Q. Yep, there we go. Now we'll go ahead and keep that one. Uh, canister we're not going to need. I might actually leave that here. Uh, the mods we're not going to need either. We'll get rid of those. And that will open us up. Actually, no, I'll keep them. Because we do need to go back with them. So let me go ahead and get some on my own and we'll be right back. Actually, hold on. Let me see. We only need two, actually. And I got two. We can always come back with bigger storage. So it's time to go back home. We got all the research that we need. We got some titanium so we get a little bit better storage. I'll go ahead and come back here and get some of that iron, some of that titanium. Uh, the beacon is already down. I put it right down here. And then we'll go ahead and grab the oxygenator. And we'll just put it down here with the rest of the stuff. Uh, the canister I'll leave here so that way I can make sure I don't forget. Let's bring the canister with me. Put the storage right there. And I think we're ready to get the hell out of here. And three, two, one, punch. So yeah, that didn't take long at all. That only took me like a half. Oh, there's another one right there. Uh, it only took me a half an hour to get all that stuff. But right there, that is our beacon. That's how we're going to find that base later on. Now we just need to get back to Silva. And if I can find it, where are you? There it is. So yeah, get back to Silva. Find our, our base. Yeah, see, the thruster just destroyed itself. So yeah, that thruster is no longer any good. I have to build another one so we can go back and grab some resources. Uh, probably two of them. I'll make one trip for iron, one trip for titanium. And there's our base. And coming in. Where is it? There it is. And a nice little smooth landing. And look at all this research we got. So, not exactly sure how much it is. You do the math. It is... Each one is worth 7,400 bytes. And there's eight of them. Let me calculate that real quick. You're not going to believe this. That's 5,900 
bytes. No, 59... 59,000 bytes. My bad. 59,000 bytes sitting in the storage right now. We're rich. We are... Yeah, that's my name, but we are rich. We got plenty of bytes to get us everything we're going to need. Uh, next thing I want to do is... I want to try to get the larger shuttle. But yeah, one thing at a time. I need to go ahead and get these on there. Uh, so next episode, what we need to think about is power. As you can see, power is a really big deal right now. Do I have any carbon? Yes, I do. Alright, so what I'm going to do is on my own. I'm going to try to get all these uh, researched up. Well, as much as we need for next episode. Because next episode, what we need, as I was saying, for power is we need to get stuff where is it oh there it is so this is the medium generator it takes tungsten which we get from the solo we will need some of those later on we will need tungsten as well but not yet we do have a medium solar panel which we do need to get uh, each planet has its own power source so on this planet the best power so uh, power source is solar so, we'll get some solar panels for this planet. Uh, on Glacio, the best power is wind. So, we'll get some wind turbines for Glacio. Uh, that one's going to take copper and glass. We don't have a whole lot of copper in the area. We'll try to get as much as we can. But if not, what we can do is we can go to another planet, which has a ton of copper. This one's easy, it's just glass and ceramic we have on this planet. Batteries, on the other hand, take lithium. Which is what we're going to go ahead and do in the next episode. We need to go to Visania so we get the lithium to make a bunch of batteries. I mean, a bunch. On each planet, we're going to have 12, 12 batteries on every planet that we build a base. Probably just this base and then Glacio. But yeah, we're going to need a ton of batteries. And then later on, when we actually get to it, we'll be able to build the RTG. But yeah, that's about all the time I have for this episode. Like I said, next episode, we'll be going to Visania. Try to get some lithium so we could, uh, yeah, get some more power. But until then, make sure to like and subscribe, all that good stuff. I'll see you all in the next one. Peace.